Okay, hey guys, this is uh, Almighty Avocado. This is a new YouTube channel that I decided to make. This is a uh, Minecraft channel. Um, eh, and probably other games too. I'm picking up Civ 5 later today. Uh, so I'll probably have some Civilization, some Minecraft, maybe some Rust in there too. I'm a big fan of these games. Even though, you know, unfortunately, as you can see, I have Mac. Um, obviously, not the best type of computer for this kind of thing, but, you know, that's what I got, and, um, so today I'm going to be showing you a combination lock that I made. Um, I like using redstone. Redstone is a lot of fun, um, and, uh, just wiring and stuff is interesting. want to be an engineer, um, so anything I can really do to make it that way and make it somewhat like engineering in Minecraft is, uh, you know what I'll do. Uh, I'm just gonna check and make sure that this is on peaceful, so no mobs spawn. Uh, my daylight cycle is already been stopped. All right, so this is my um combo lock. Uh, right now it doesn't have any order in which that it has to be put in, but it it has to have, it has a combination but it doesn't have an order so we're gonna use this command block just a teleportation command block to bring me inside then so these are the levers and then this is test so um push that button when you have your thought command in so I think I remember my combo, so I'm pretty sure it's one, three, six. So then we'll test. Oh, all right. Well, there didn't want to test that already, but um, all right. So that that you just saw was when it inputs the wrong code. So when it inputs the wrong code, it activates this command block, um, which teleports you into the void and kills you. Um, and this one just says wrong code. Um, so, I was going to do a kill command block, because uh, this is the 1.8 snapshot, but it's not, I don't, I'm not very great with commands. Uh, so I just stuck to the teleporting to the void. Uh, so what is this one? Is this one... Two, three, seven, maybe? Nope, that one's wrong as well. Anyways, uh, so that just happened again. So basically the way this works is it, so when you light up a uh, lever, it sends the pulse, the not a pulse, it sends the signal, the redstone signal, um, up these, uh, wires and oh well there's the combination two three two five six that's the combination already all right so when you flip two five six two no that's four five six these three wires are gonna lit up and it's gonna go to this gate now for those of you that don't know how gates work um I'm just going to get rid of the redstone signal so you can see. So this is what a gate, when it's not activated, looks like. So that's that's a three-slot gate, which then you have to have one of these. But this is, this is a simple gate. So a simple gate is set up like this. So you take the three blocks, redstone torch, redstone, two repeaters, and then you put a redstone torch here. So this is, a gate is what you use when you want to have two signals, uh, when you need to have two signals activated, um, to then go on to the next part of what you want to do. So, as you can see, neither of these are activated. So, but it won't work when I activate one because this redstone is still lit, so therefore this torch is still going to be off. So when one is lit, it's not going to go on. When the other is lit it's not going to go on. But when both are on, then this signal can send. So that's how a uh, 
gate works. Now there are several gates in this design. Um, so this is a 3x1 gate, as you can see. So what it does is it activates these three, so then when these three are all off, these two turn on, and then it activates the simple gate that I just showed you. And then it goes to this last gate. So this is the true this is this means that I did it correctly, and then it's just waiting for the signal from the button. So when I send the signal from the button, it as you could probably see, it turns this on and opens the door. So that's how the right combo works. Now with the wrong combo, it basically does the same thing. Um, so if I flip any one of these wrong uh, levers and then push the button, it's going to teleport me, as you saw. Uh, I don't feel like dying again. So, see, this is lit. So then this wire, this is the wrong wire, essentially. So then it comes up to a gate up here, waits for the button to be pressed, and I guess I'll show you. Teleports me to the void, as you can see. So I'm just going to take that off. So that's how that works. This is how the combo lock works. So this is just a simple uh, explanation of how this works. Uh, if you want, I might make a tutorial on how to make it. It's, it's fun to play with, but it doesn't have any practical value yet on, server, on like a server or something. Because it would be pretty easy for someone to just destroy the redstone and make it into your thing and make it into whatever you're trying to hide and also um, there are no command blocks you can't make a command block obviously so you could like make like I don't know trap doors with lava underneath it um, that was what one of my prototypes had but that one was a bit uh, faulty because um, some of the wires ran into each other and it was just kind of a mess so I decided to put this on a super flat and make it nice and organized for you so you might see a tutorial for this on um, my channel uh, don't forget to rate comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time